Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be sharing my cheap and easy small bathroom DIY remodel and giving you a before and after tour and can hopefully give you some ideas for your own budget friendly bathroom projects. Here's an overview of the before of my bathroom. It wasn't bad but there were just a lot of things that were starting to fall apart and just needed some attention. I had painted it this purpley pink color probably three years ago that I really liked but now my tastes have kind of changed. One of the major issues in this bathroom is the beadboard was caulked and glued together but not never painted so dust and dirt had gathered into all the unpainted caulking and just looked gross and could never get clean. There was a lot of scuffing and marks on the beadboard. And then in the tile flooring, the grout had started to get really gross, discolored, and cracking. My bathtub is a really old cast iron tub, but it had just become super discolored over the years and there started to get some moldish discoloration in my caulking as well. And then for the shower tiles, even though those were relatively new in the last few years, the dark grout has completely discolored and despite all my efforts in trying to clean it, it stays hazed and gross. I didn't spend a lot of money on this project. I used a lot of things that I had from other projects around the house. So to remove all the old caulking in the different places in my bathroom, I used this handy little tool that I think I found at Home Depot. Here's where I started to rip out all the old caulking that had gotten gross and discolored on the baseboards. I filled in some of the holes from the old towel racks since I knew I was going to change those up and I pulled down the old vanity mirror. Of course after I ripped out all the old caulking I taped off the area after cleaning it really well so that I could do a really clean caulk line. I didn't end up filming a lot of the process of actually redoing the bathroom just because I was on a time crunch and didn't want to fuss around with it. So I don't have a lot of footage of that, but here is the final reveal. I replaced my traditional towel rod with this kind of DIY hook system that I made. I ordered this new medicine cabinet off of Amazon that was extremely affordable. And since I have a tiny bathroom, this was a really good piece because it creates lots of extra storage. Although you can still see some of the weird original glue lines in the beadboard, the fresh coat of paint really helped conceal it and make the appearance overall look much better. Fresh clean caulk lines absolutely make my heart sing and I think just completely transform a room. Again, since this bathroom is super tiny, maximizing storage was really important for me. So I have this little caddy mounted to the wall that holds all of my hair goodies. I fixed the grout situation in my tiles by scraping out what cracked grout was in there and just applying a new layer of grout, which is something I had left over from another project, so I didn't spend any money on that. This grout color happened to be a couple shades lighter than the previous one, so I think it really helped lighten the overall aesthetic of the bathroom. Now for my dark grout that I have in my shower, I actually bought a grout paint at Home Depot for the dark charcoal color and just went in and touched it all up with a little paintbrush as per the directions. I will have the product linked in the description box. It's crazy how much of a difference this made to these tiles. And for the tub, I used one of the tub and tile paint kits from Rust-Oleum, which I think worked amazingly. I would highly recommend this product for anyone who has a tub or shower that needs an update. I will also have that linked in the description box too. This made a huge difference to the overall aesthetic of this room. 
Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and maybe got a little bit of inspiration from this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. I would love to have you subscribe to my channel if you're into home renovation or makeover videos just like this one. And I'll see you guys next time.